Hi guys, it's Charlie Girl 4, and I know that I already talked en enough about Breadwinners, but I would like to say um, two more things about it, and then I'm going to do my own little Sunday and Craig rants. I'm not in this video, but in a different video. <laughs> but I would like to say two little things about Breadwinners, and that is um, um, the art style again, that, and that is the thing is that, like I said about the art style, it's uh, horrendously lazy. And here's the thing, like I mentioned before, the main characters look nothing like ducks. Oh, I know a lot of people, uh, people will say, it's a cartoony art style, it's not supposed to be re realistic, bull freaking crap. I mean, Daffy Duck is an uh, is uh, extremely realistic re representation of a duck, but uh, pretty much everybody can tell what he is. And Donald Duck isn't supposed to be a, 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 a realistic representation of a duck, yet we can tell what he is. And heck, even Mordecai from regular show, we can pretty much all tell that he's a blue jay. But yet these things, these breadwinners, are supposed to pass up as ducks. They look like weird humanoid frog-fish hybrids, not freaking ducks. I mean, the My Little Ponies aren't really that... I'm just bringing it up. I mean, the My Little Ponies aren't really re that realistic as the actual horses, and I'm glad they are. I uh, actual horses are actually kind of ugly, and the My Little Ponies aren't actually that realistic to actual horses. Pretty much none of the generations are, but at least we can tell that they are in fact ponies. So yeah, that's not excuse. That's not excuse for the horrible laziness in capturing ducks that is breadwinners. I mean, like, if they called, if, 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 if it was about fish, it probably would have been just as believable. I mean, they don't even have beaks. Their lips. Their freaking lips. Like Rebel Taxi said, they look more like frogs than they do ducks. And even then, they look more like fish than they do ducks. Okay. Now that's out of the way, I found something horrifying while looking through DeviantArt. Okay, I was searching breadwinners for DeviantArt. Why? I'm bored. Don't don't ask me what I do in my free time. Do I go, go around asking you what you do in your free time? No. So anyways, I searched breadwinners of DeviantArt, and I found something, um, horrifying. A lot of you may, um, already know that, um, from the large majority of people who hate breadwinners, there is a teensy, weeny, tiny, whiny, little minority that actually likes breadwinners. What do I think of these people? Well, they're not horrible people for liking something that I obviously hate. I mean, maybe there's something in breadwinners from all of this horribleness that they actually like about it. I mean, Audrey like I mean, my friend Audrey likes Sanjay and Craig. It. I think it's an awful show. So, you never know. Maybe, maybe they just like it because they're bored and they have nothing better to do. But seriously, I'd have b better chances with Red and Stippy. So, anyways, that. Um, yeah, through the fan art of Breadwinners, I found this. I found out that there is Breadwinners Shipping. Yes, that's right, Breadwinners Shipping. There's even a ship called Swedoos and other shippings among the Breadwinners community. Seriously. Freaking seriously. I've seen bad shippings, you know, like Sonato or Spider Pull, but this. People actually ship breadwinners. Okay, screw it. I'm gonna shoot myself. I I'm gonna kill myself. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill myself with these scissors. Ugh. I've lost, I've now lost all faith in humanity, pretty much. Okay. Forget that over the top freak out. So yeah, it's kind of sad knowing that there is breadwinner shipping. But then again, it seems as if anything can either be liked or hated, no matter what, whether it is good or bad. I mean, um, for example, um, um, what's that? What's that movie called? Um, there actually are a few uh, dumb people out there who like the disaster movies like that. I mean, so that proves something. But I just can't find anything good in Breadwinners at all. Just my honest opinion. Okay. Hmm. Um. 
now going through more. It's just that it's just really not fair in how it's just it's just really not fair when I'm talking about um this. I like horrible crap like breadwinners gets green lighted. Yet there are so many other animations on YouTube that are great and has billion times more effort uh, uh, effort than breadwinners. I mean, I mean, what what about Ed's World? I'd much rather see an Ed's World show on Nickelodeon than I'd rather uh, uh, rather watch um, a breadwinners show. And guess what? Um, Ed's World has no effort um, put into it. I'm not saying it has no effort by that means, but it really has no big animation team. And yet, even the art style and overall is better. Like, we need a breadwin. I mean, no. We need um, an Edgeworld show, not a breadwinner's show. That is pretty much what we need. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. Stop. This is gonna make. It's, it's, I just can't. Bye, guys.